Hello again, everyone. Welcome back and welcome to Sunny the Grill, Jamaica. I'm at the Couple Swept Away Resort here in the Grill, and behind me is the beautiful Caribbean. Now, today we are going to look at the new Perdomo 10th Anniversary Maduro. Six by 54 box pressed. There's the density. Now, um, I'm sure there's a very good reason, and I don't know what it is. How about that? And But, uh, of course, they have the Maduro 20th anniversary. Uh, I, I feel sure this is tied in with the FDA regulation somehow. But regardless, they have, this is now in a sun-grown and a Maduro, and we're just going to uh, look at the Maduro today. So, let's get right to it. The new Perdomo 10th anniversary... Maduro. I would call this a soft uh, box press because it's not really, really sharp. Okay, it draws pretty good. Some distinctive chocolate fudge notes some black coffee quite a bit of brown sugar um, a little nutmeg you can tell us there but it's not in the way right now because what you're going to really notice is the chocolate fudge and uh, brown sugar and of course there is a black coffee base there's no way you're going to get away from that with the maduro but it is nice very dark but very sweet so uh Let's see what we have in the first third. All right, we're right here at the first third. And uh, really the flavor notes are about like I described. The cigar is very sweet. Now you've got a lot of chocolate fudge notes. A lot of coffee. The nutmeg is sort of creamy consistency and it doesn't really take away from the sweet notes. It just sort of helps it flow. The, uh, hold on, let's see something. There's black pepper, but it's not very heavy. Uh, it's only about seven. Which is okay because you're going to be interested and notice those nice chocolate notes, and they're very sweet. You're going to like that. And it's a fu chocolate fudge. You know how you know what fudge tastes like. It's more or less like that. The finish is sort of a um, chocolate, straight chocolate and nutmeg, uh, smooth. And some nice lingering black pepper. The, the, actually, you know, the lingering black pepper might be a little better than the front end black pepper, or you will notice it more because it is the finish. But this is a very tasty cigar. Um, for the first third, I would rate it 95. It's very sweet, which you know me. Uh, over the years, you know me. If it's, if it's Maduro, it's got to have some sweetness. It can't just be all chocolate or uh, like dark chocolate, unsweetened dark chocolate. No, this is a sweet fudge, fudgy chocolate, and uh, a lot of brown sugar. So let's move on to the second third, but the first third is pretty good. here we are at the end of the second third and basically uh, not much has changed I would call it medium to full bodied but the uh, 
It was at this point that the computer actually got a little too hot and overheated. So uh, I had to uh, bring it inside the room and let it cool off. And the final third was fine. But to finish up the second third, as I said, nothing much changed. You still had the chocolate fudge notes, very sweet, very dark, lots of coffee. Really nothing changed. So I didn't change the score. I held 95 for the second third. So now, let's resume with the beach part of the video and the final third. Well, we are down to the end, so let's wrap it up. First of all, a little background. I may be, I don't know until I look at this back, but uh, I have to do this at one certain time of day because of the uh, sun. <laughs> I want the sun on my face and I want the ocean in the background. So I'm doing this around 11 to 12 so that, because the sun will be right in my face in about an hour. And yesterday it rained, but we get it today. But as far as the cigar goes, not much has changed. Now, the nutmeg has come out a little more in the final third. And the extreme fudge chocolate flavor dipped a little. You know where I'm going with this. It is going to drop, but only by one point to 94. This is an excellent cigar. It is medium to full-bodied, leaning toward full-bodied. The finish is basically unchanged. But... Uh, Nick has once again done a very good job. Perdomo makes a good Maduro. I don't think we're going to have much argument with that. But uh, this is a very good cigar. And uh, I do have the Sun Grown, which I may do uh, later this week. We'll be here till Saturday. And the day is uh, Sunday, I had to think. So uh, this is a beautiful resort. And uh, uh, it's quite spread out. But your overall score is 94.67. I believe Nick and everyone in Perdomo will be pleased with that. This is a very good cigar. So uh, that'll do it. The new Perdomo 10th Anniversary Maduro Epicure 6x54 box pressed. I'll call it a soft box pressed. 94.67.